Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. I'm KeyDelphin954 and today I'm starting a brand new series. This series will be critiquing GFX, but do not worry, there'll, be, there'll still be tutorials, there'll still be new videos, just a new series to add to it. So now you're probably wondering, what do you mean GFX critiquing? How do I do this? What do you mean? Well, what I mean is, in my Discord server, you had a chance to submit GFX and I'd be critiquing it. Now, this channel will be here for a long, long time, so I'll be making many videos on all the GFX, many different parts, so I hope you enjoy, I hope I help you get a little better, and yeah, let's begin. So first up is this GFX by Snarky or Eend, and it is very good, but the first thing that really spots, that really catches my eye is the Snarky's graphic text. So that text is a totally different color from the background, it's much darker, but the, but the background is more brighter. So you want to work on making it match more and then the text i mean not the text the head the head kind of looks pink if you look at it very closely it looks very pinkish reddish then the middle has that yellow spot on it it's way too bright so you might want to lower the opacity and make it smaller and in the background i think you should get new brushes or try to work on those more try to work on adding the colors better because the bottom of the gfx background is like the same exact color and then the top has more of a mix Try to do that on the bottom too. And then I suggest working on overlays too. Try to add those. The pose is pretty okay, it looks good. And yeah. Next up is this GFX. I don't know how to pronounce your name, but I like I like it a lot. I'm not great at critiquing ads, so I'm gonna try my best. Um, maybe you could have worked on adding effects. Like the render could have had an outer glow, like a small inner glow. And then the background looks pretty nice. The text maybe you could have worked on, like in the bottom. There's just a ton of different fonts. It's okay though, I like it. Now this one, I'll try my best to critique. I can't see much though, cause of the watermarks. However, I see that it's very green and the background looks like it's one plain color from what I can see. And then you have that tiny overlay of the uh, starburst. Maybe add more, then the render could use more effects. Once again, like an outer glow or like a, something to make it pop. And the pose is okay. Maybe the other arm could have a better pose. Um, the left arm from my side, I think, or right for you. I don't know. And then example, that text could definitely have a better font and it could be having like a better work, maybe a better, you know, better way for it to be placed. Now, Snarky, once again, the render looks a little too pink, but it still looks good. I like the way you did it. The lighting looks much better than the last time. And then the background, once again, maybe find different brushes or try to add brushes to this one too. Now the text, I can see that there's like Inside of it, there's a clipping clipping mask thing in it. And you can see the lines kind of fade out of the text because the outer glow, when you're adding the outer glow and you're adding the clipped lines, you want to make sure you do the outer glow after clipping it or else the lines will be seen on the outer glow as well. And then the bottom half of the GFX is once again like the same shade. So you might want to work on that. Next up, I see this person has definitely watched my videos, so shout out to you. And if you haven't, well, that's embarrassing. But um, I like it. What I want you to work on, though, is the lighting. And you can see that white dot in the middle. Try working on that because it's a little too big and doesn't really match. And now the text could have a better font. And it could also bring it lower. So if you move the text a little lower, like right over here. I like the overlays on the corners. Those are really good. However, try to make this one a little smaller and move it to the side. Mess with the shape a little bit, too. Now you can't really see the render, so possibly you could definitely remove this thing right over here in the bottom left corner. You could definitely remove it and replace it with something better. Maybe add more overlay. The background looks good. Try adding more colors like the white, since there's white over here, maybe add it to the background. That's all I can really say. Oh, and your render. The outer glow, maybe change it to like a different color. I can't tell if it's an inner or outer glow. But um, try to make it less white, like make it a different color. Now we have Ivan over here, one of the PR officers at DXD. So this looks great, fantastical, but the only thing I can really say is the outer glows on the text and the render. Try to remove the gray because the gray kind of makes it look bad and replace it with like, maybe since it's red, you could replace it with a red one or a yellow one. I don't know. Try your best though until you see it really pop. But it looks amazing already, so great job on that. Now this one. I can see there's a bevel on the F3X text and it's gray. So once again, maybe change the color from gray to something like white or black or like a darker purple. The background looks pretty cool. Maybe add more effects onto the render like an outer glow or an inner glow, stuff like that. That's usually what I do, but it looks fantastic once again. 
And then a final one from Ivan, I believe, is this one. I love it, it's pretty good. However, I would say work on the text a little bit. The gradient, I don't like the red and green gradient together. Maybe you could have done a different approach to it. And then the character on the left is way too bright. You can see over here is a little bright. The background, once again, very good. And work on the stroke, maybe make it a little thinner, but it kind of depends on how it look. But I mean, it's pretty good. All right, now we have Kai Kahiaro. Kahiaro, I don't know how to pronounce your name, but I mean, sorry. Um, looks great. However, I would say mess with the background a little bit. It doesn't really match the theme because you're saying it's a rainforest, but that's like a beach. Maybe make it something more like that or make it like a brush background. Then the corner overlays, you could have made a gradient on it or mess with the effects more instead of having it plain white. Now the text, I would say the, I see you use the pen tool on it or something and then you clipped it onto the text. If you're gonna do that, I suggest making it a little darker to match it a little bit more because it's very bright compared to that. You can see a huge difference. The render could also have more effects to make it pop out more, have it have an outer glow or a drop shadow, something like that. But overall, pretty good. Now this one by ADS, I don't know, ADCRSE, I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, so the D Oracle, I can't pronounce this man, D Oracle text, um, you could have added like maybe a stroke and then an outer glow, maybe like a bevel. I, th I think there is a bevel, I can't tell though. Maybe make it a different white. Make it white, oh, I can't tell, okay. Then the background, I like it. However, you could mess with the brushes a little more. I don't really think those brushes would look good. You could definitely find a better one. Then in the corner, that brush could be changed as well. And then the render looks great, the pose is great. Maybe work on lighting a little bit more and then adding more effects. And now we're almost done, we have about two more left. All right, now we have one by Kiwis, I think that's how you pronounce it, no idea. However, let's go ahead and critique. So when I first look at this, it's very good. However, at the corner overlay right over here is way too big and it takes up more than the render does. So I suggest making it way smaller, move it over here a little bit more. And then the text could definitely be something different, a different font. And then after you find a different font for the text, I would say work on adding more effects onto it instead of a plain color and then a stroke. Now the background has spanned little droplets of paint and I would say, try to find a better one, a better brush. Now the render, the lighting is very basic. So I would say work on that, maybe use someone's light room or make your own light room. And then I see you're trying to do the outer glow. Maybe try doing a different color and make it different, a different lighting setting, if that's what it's called. I don't know what it's called. Oh, um, like when you make an overlay and hard light, stuff like that, mess with that around. And then also when I see the background, I see there is a giant, little line thing poking around the background. I don't know what it's called, but I would say remove it and just work on adding brushes a little better. Now we have this one by Finonze4321. I like this a lot, it's very nice. I don't know if you made that render, it kind of looks familiar. Maybe you did, I don't know. But it looks great, the render has perfect lighting. I love it. And then it has a great outer glow on it. Now the background is pretty good. And then there's that liquify. The liquify is kind of random, but I know many people do that nowadays. I'm not really a fan of it. Maybe replace it with something different, but it looks great. Now you see the text and it says example. I would say maybe change the font of it or work on the warp on it because it's kind of uneven and it's kind of like bothering me a little bit. So I would work on that. Maybe add more effects like a bevel because it's pretty plain. It just has the gradient and then a stroke. So I'd work on that. And that's all for today. There will be more in the next video, hopefully. Also, if you couldn't already tell, there's a new banner on my YouTube channel right over here um and yeah anyways peace out have a nice day i hope you enjoyed the video i hope i helped you and yeah see you in the next one bye